Hey y'all, this is Jen with Sassy Southern NC Girl. Happy Valentine's Day. I hope you are all having a wonderful day. Um, happy Tea Tuesday. I'm actually doing a Tea Tuesday for the first time in a minute. Um, but, um, first of all, I have to wear this, you guys, because I promised my girl Tanya from Side Gear Crafts <laughs> that I would wear this. But I can't talk with it. I tried. So, I'm just going to put them in. It's a lollipop, y'all, and it's so good, and it's sparkly lips. So, I could, I did it, girl, but I couldn't keep them in. Cause otherwise, I'd be talking like this. <laughs> but they're really cute. They're sparkly. And she sent them to me for a swap that we did. And by the way, this lollipop is really good. It's strawberry. Mm. Anyway. <laughs> so, I am drinking my... Patent Diet Mountain Dew, <laughs> my trademark. So I have some happy mail that I want to share, and I have an update um, for my birthday challenge and giveaway, which is now over. Um, but I did receive another entry over the weekend, and I have a couple more coming. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put those people's names in and I'm gonna draw and I know I was supposed to draw on Sunday y'all but I was sick all weekend I felt terrible and matter of fact I still felt bad up until last night and I still have a slight headache today but I feel better I don't know what it was but I was like nauseous um no fever um I had a headache um off and on not the whole time just felt blah I'm not I don't even know what it was and it may have been nothing it might have just been over tiredness and stress y'all like my gnome shirt I got it at Cracker Barrel <laughs> my husband bought it for me um, and I'm wearing my matching um, hair bow from Dollar Tree and I can't remember where I got these but they match perfectly I love this print um, so anyway I'm going to do the drawing this week, but I'm still going to put those people's names in there, except for the one person who told me not to. Okay, so first of all, we have this beautiful sunflower card. It's from Robin Sadowski. Thank you so much, Robin. And it says, thank you for the Christmas card. Hoping you and the family are well. Thanks for supporting my channel. God bless, Robin Sadowski. And she put some super cute stickers in there. And then also she sent me some extra stickers. These are so cute. Thank you so much, Robin. And I apologize. I've actually had this for about a week. But I, like I said, y'all, I don't know what it was. It was the end of last week. Um, the whole weekend. And then, um... Yesterday, yesterday I came home. What did I do yesterday? Yesterday I came home. I had to take my daughter to Academy Sports to buy her some stuff for softball. And then I got home and I was so sick. I ordered, um, I ordered chicken pasta from, um, chicken Alfredo from Domino's. I didn't even eat it. I fell asleep. It was terrible. I mean, I can't even, can't even describe it, um, but I'm feeling much better today. <laughs> um, so the second one is from Lou David and she decorated it with this really cute, um, hummingbird sticker. It's a puffy sticker. There's, um, a die cut heart and then there's this heart with the, um, geometric heart this really cute um i'm gonna try to save this somehow and maybe put it in my journal or or something because um and then this sticker here because this is so cute and i love the color of this envelope she knows green's my favorite color so thank you lou and then the card has a sweet little heart sticker on it and then the actual card is rainbows which i love 
and it says, Hey Jennifer, thanks so much for the Christmas card and sharing stash. Someone, I'm sorry, sharing stash. <laughs> Someone else's stash makes me find creativity, so I have to share my creations. Thank, thanks again, Lou David. Now y'all, wait till I show y'all what she made with what I sent her. I would have never thought to do what she did but it's amazing and I have glitter on my face. I'm not sure why because I don't have, I don't have anything glittery. So she made me two cards with the stuff I sent her. Okay. So I sent, um, I sent some stickers and some embellishments. Look what she made with, so I sent her this little thing, the, this and this, everything else she did, but look at that Christmas card y'all. I mean, how, cute it is so cute I love it the tag is embossed I don't know if you can see it the tree is embossed and then it's just blank inside so I can send it to somebody and it says handmade by Lou David on the back and she did send me an envelope that's that's the first card now the second card I sent her the happy birthday and the flowers and look what she made. How beautiful is that y'all? It's gorgeous. And again, blank inside so I can send it to somebody. It's absolutely beautiful. I love it. And I never would, and I love that she sent this to me because then that inspires me because then I can, I see things that like I wouldn't have thought of, but that's not all y'all. She also made me a bunch of tags. Okay. So, one of the tags, I don't think has anything I sent her on it, which is fine. The um, four of the tags have stickers that I sent her. And then the last tag is using some of that um, rainbow bling trim I sent. Because I sent it to y'all until it ran out. And once it ran out, um, I didn't have any more. But she also took the stamp on the package and put it on here. And it is so cool. So let me show you that first. So it's this purple tag. And she's foam, popped up on foam the butterfly stamp that I sent her. And then here's some of that rainbow bling trim. Isn't that cute? And then she put some um, baker's twine. How cute is that, y'all? And then this one doesn't have anything that, that I um, gave her, but it's so cute. It's got this little doily um, die cut with that little red truck with Christmas presents and a tree in the back. And then there's a little flower and a bow. It's so cute. And then this twine. And on the back, it says, do not open until December 25th. <laughs> so cute. Okay, and now the rest are little gnomes, and they all say do not open until December 25th, but they're all different, y'all. So look at this one. How cute is that? This is just the clear stickers I sent, and she made it into this. How cute is that? So, like, if you're doing um, a collaboration or a swap, and people um, will put on there, like, don't just put stickers on it, this is a good example of using a sticker but it not looking like you used a sticker because you can't even tell that that's a sticker. Like I know it's a sticker, but like, it's so cute and I never would have thought to do this. And then it's got the red and uh, green twine. I absolutely love these. I can't wait to use them. I almost don't even want to put them on a package. <laughs> like I almost want to put them in a journal. Here's the other, another one. And this one has the red and white and these little um, diamond dots. That is so cute. I love this. And then this one has a little button with a cute little bow. And then some more diamond dots. I just am I'm obsessed with this. It's so cute. And then um, last but not least is this one. And it has a little, one of the little snowflakes. This is just so cute, Lou. Thank you so much. I love it. And then last for the Happy Mail 
is a, a Galantine card from Suzanne Reed. Girl, you are the sweetest. So she made this card and it says, you stole my heart. And it's this cute little raccoon and little hearts. And it says handmade by Suzanne Reed. And it is blank inside, so I could reuse it if I wanted to. And let me cover up her address. And on the front is this cute little Snoopy sticker. And then we have this Americana stamp, American flag stamp, which I love. And her note says, hi, Jen. Here's a little happy mail to brighten your day and say happy Galentine's Day. You are so sweet, and I just want you to know I appreciate you and your channel. Hugs, Suzanne Reed. I almost cried when I opened this today, and it did come today, I think. It might have come yesterday. Y'all didn't check the mail yesterday because I was so sick. And then she sent me some die cuts. I love this. Deal with it. Y'all, my son... Um, so, I don't know um, if you guys remember the Rugrats. Um, and at the end of the cartoon, um, and their last name was Pickles, Tommy Pickles. But at the end of it, when he had like a little brother, they named him Dil Dylan or Dill. And they called him Dill Pickles. Well, my son is Dylan. And so, we called him Dill Pickle. And so, anytime I see Pickles or Dill Pickles, like... I think of my son and when we went to Austria the most bizarre thing they had these pickles or cucumbers <laughs> like statues or something and my son said that's those are my people I have to go take a picture with that mom he was like eight or nine <laughs> it was the cutest thing so I have a picture of him hugging that pickle statue <laughs> or it's not really a statue because there's no face on it it's just a pickle but it was so funny but every time I see a dill pickle, I think of my son. We belong together. That's so cute. Don't go baking my heart. <laughs> That's cute. And then hot diggity dog. These are so cute. So thank you so much, Suzanne. That really made my day to get that today. And I'm opening it on Valentine's Day because I opened it right before this video just to make sure it wasn't an entry, even though I'm pretty sure you already sent me an entry, but so thank you i will list those channels below so if you're not already subscribed to them please consider subscribing i don't think suzanne does um content on her channel but i keep hoping she will because she's very talented um but yeah that's it i'm gonna cut this short um i have another birthday challenge entry that will go up tomorrow um, this evening, you will see a video for hashtag 10 Minute Tuesday, which I'm co-hosting with Tanya from Psychic Crafts. Um, and then hopefully I can stay in my groove this week and keep putting content up. I have some haul videos um, to share. And I think that's it for now. So, I hope you are having a wonderful day. Just remember, guys, that I love you today and every day. And I am so thankful to have you and your support on my channel. It means the world to me. Um, and remember, in a world where you can be anything, be kind. Because so many people out there need it. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.